Did you know that the best way to start to learn animation is the bouncing ball? The bouncing ball is a great way to understand the basics of animation in both 2D or 3D. Let's watch how it's done. Keyframes are added whenever we make the ball move to a new position. How can we make it look like it's bouncing in a realistic way? A bouncing ball is affected by the force of gravity and the ground. As the ball is dropped, it gains speed. When it hits the ground, it quickly changes direction and increases speed again before slowing down by the force of gravity to repeat the cycle. The speed of the ball needs to change over time and we do this with a simple speed graph which I add to the ball's motion. Another way to animate a bouncing ball is to let the computer do all the work. This is called a simulation, and they can be a lot of fun. <laughs> 